And speaking of other stars, would you please welcome a great friend of mine who you've seen working with me in the past, and we've done a lot together. I'd like you to really give him a nice big round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, here he is, the fabulous Wayne Dobson. <laughs> to me tonight, Wayne, keep your show short. So in conclusion, <laughs> I'd like to introduce to you a gentleman from the audience. His name is Keith. Step this way, Keith. <laughs> Great to have you up there, Keith. Thank you very much indeed. We've never met before. Nope. No? Well, how do you know it's me? Could be somebody else. I will show you a great trick with your tie. Have you seen this before? Where you take a piece of thread from the tie and you just pull and the thread comes out. It's really strange. You just do that and it comes out. It's really weird. You just take it and you pull and it comes out. You can do it with the coat as well. It's great. Do it with anything. You just take it and you pull it out. I can do it with any... No, I won't. No. What I would do is... <clears throat> I'm going to show you a great trick. They did ask you to bring a high currency note, like a 10 or a 20 pound note. Did you bring it with you? Okay. Yes? Okay. What have you got? Ten. You've got a 10 pound note. Okay. What I'd like you to do is this. I'd like you to take this pen, Keith, and sign your name on the face of the 10 pound note. Now, the face is the opposite side from the back. Sorry. Okay. Sign your name. Okay? To do this trick, you must be the same distance away from me as I am from you. <laughs> it's very important. Okay? It's a long one. Good. Keith? Chatham. Chatham. Chatham up? Okay. Keith Chatham. Chatham down. Okay. I'm going to show you two things. Firstly, now you only pretend to tear it, but you don't really. <laughs> but your face goes white and you do pay attention, all right? <laughs> Secondly, you fold in half once, you fold in half twice, Keith. You fold in half three, four, and five times. Once you've done that, you take that between your finger and thumb. Would you do that for me? You're working so well. Also, with the trick, we need this. This is an envelope or an envelope, depends which part of the country you come from. Where do you come from? Newcastle. Newcastle. In that case, it's a uh, why it's an envelope. Now, <laughs> what I will do is I'm going to take your ten pounds and place it inside the envelope or the envelope or the envelope. You can actually see it go inside. You yeah. agree with that, yeah? yeah? Now, I hate the taste of these flaps. So what I'll do is do that. You don't mind? No. Of course not. It's better than you doing it. <laughs> now, what I'm going to do, inside my pocket, I have a clip, all right? A small clip, like that. I'm going to take this envelope and fold it in half so there's no way your 10 pound can escape from there. Yeah. Agree with that? Yeah. You can actually feel it. Have a feel. Can you feel it? Yes. Oh, you're feeling so nice. <laughs> also, for the trick, we need this. These are tweezers. Now. What I'm going to do, you know there's a lot of counterfeit notes going around? Yes. You know that. Yes. The way to test them is to apply heat. <laughs> now, if they burn, they're genuine. <laughs> if they don't, they're not. Okay? So what we do is we apply heat underneath the envelope. All right? Like so. So remember, <laughs> it must have been a genuine one. <laughs> so, we apply this heat. But don't worry, it's only a gag. Because back here, I have this. What I'm going to do is, would you step over this way? Over the trapdoor? Thank you. <laughs> You'll be amazed at this, Keith. Your £10 note will not burn. The envelope will, but the £10 note will not burn. OK? Watch this. In amongst the ashes <laughs> is your... Gone wrong. <laughs> Do you know your bank manager well? Yes, very well. Great. Go to him tomorrow morning. <laughs> say, you saw the great Wayne Dobson. He will say, who? You say, Wayne Dobson. He took my ten pound note and he destroyed it in flames. And he gave me these ashes. And he will tell you exactly what to do with them. <laughs> <laughs> if all else fails, I'll show you another trick. All right? I have a bag here. Do you know what's inside? Fruit, how do you know? It's you guess. Okay. Would you like to see what I've got in here? Yes. Okay, I'm going to show you. You don't know what sort of fruit, do you? Mm. You don't? No. no. You don't know? No. Are you okay? Yes. Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Nothing wrong? No. <laughs> this is an apple. Ooh. <laughs> this is a... Orange. <laughs> This is a banana. Ooh. <laughs> and two tissues. Ooh. 
Apple? Yeah. Orange? Uh-huh. Banana? Point 22. Your fingers like that and point. Brilliant. Pick them up and put one in each pocket. Excellent. Trouser pocket, please. <laughs> <coughs> Great. Leave them there. Now, for those of you who have just tuned in, this is an apple and this <laughs> is a... And this is a banana. Ooh. Hold your hand out for me. That's great. What I'm going to do is take these two tissues, a white one... Yeah. ...and a... Red one. Okay. <laughs> ...and a banana. Ooh. <laughs> you OK? Yes. Good. I got ladies' knickers on. <laughs> You ready for this, Keith? Yeah. Good. I'm going to take it and peel it. Once, twice, three times. Break it in half, which is better known as a banana split. Oh. <laughs> Place that there. Can you see anything inside there, Keith? Yes. yes. It's, in fact, a piece of paper which looks like a ten-pound note. I'm going to take it out and not touch it, all right? I'll take it out of there. All right, what I'd like you to do is take that and I would like you to wipe it clean. Would you do that for me, Keith? Just wipe it with the tissue. Once you've done that, I'd like you then to unfold it. Once you've unfolded it, after you've wiped it... <laughs> Shall I take that? You yeah. can. You don't mind? No. Unfold it, because the question is, on that £10 note should be a name. Is that your name? It's it is, good. yes, it must be your £10 note. Thank you very much indeed. You've done great. OK? Thank you very much, Keith. Thank you, too. Great audience. Thank you.